Google, Amazon says we want to identify the top STEM students, the top coders in high schools. And they find one Saginaw and they go in there and they say, we're going to pay you $20,000 and you're going to come intern for us in the summer. And then maybe when you get out of college, you come work for us instead of the competition. They would write that up in the newspaper. They would put that on TV. It would be an outreach program. It would be a way to inspire young students. It would be tremendous. What's the difference? If Google and Amazon say that kid's worth 20 grand to us to come out here for the summer. In fact, if they said you need to come out here for the summer and we don't pay you, you say that's absolutely terrible. But because of amateurism and because an entire industry has made billions off of the concept of you have to do this for free. No one's telling that kid you need to code for the love of coding. No one's saying you should go work for Google for the love of Google. What is the difference? There's none except they have sold this concept of amateurism to America and then they sold a lot of commercials during the NCAA basketball tournament around it. This is a business. This is not amateur athletics. There's nothing amateur that makes billions of dollars. The NCAA brings in every year a billion dollars just in television licensing for college basketball. And so you have a multi-billion dollar licensing business and none of these people are paying any taxes on the money. The NCAA is a non-profit that pays no taxes. The conferences are non-profits, they pay no taxes. You can cry victim, right? And pretend you're a victim and then keep getting paid and just keep the system the same. It's perfect. Here's the reason why I'm different from the NCAA. I guess I made money. So did the people with me. So did the players. I never took anything from them. The NCAA acts as if they are bigger than the athlete. If the athletes were all white and the, and the coaches and athletic directors were all black, there's no way this would be happening. College athletics is a lot of fun and it brings communities together. It does a lot of great things.